today's encouraging word comes from the book of Zechariah, chapter 4, and we'll read verse number 10. And it says, For who hath despised the day of small things? Amen. We praise God. Um, everything doesn't start out big. Everything doesn't start out being super successful. Everything doesn't start out the way we may have envisioned it. In fact, many times, the things that we envision are always harder than when we were contemplating them over in our mind. And sometimes that leads to frustration, and it leads people to give up, because the challenges were more severe than we had anticipated. Um, but whatever the case may be, whether it's because of the challenges or whether it's just because the magnitude of the endeavor doesn't seem to match up to the, to the size of the vision, please understand that there are times when things start off small, but they end up great. And conversely, there are things that start out too big and they cannot sustain themselves and they crumble under their own weight. So let us be patient. Amen. Whether it's something that we are endeavoring in the ministry, in our personal lives, in our careers, uh, with our families, don't despise the small beginning. Uh, don't be uh, frustrated because it seems as if other people are operating at a higher level than you are. It's okay. God has a plan for you, and he has a timing for his plan to come to pass. If God has spoken a vision, he'll bring it to pass. It's just a matter of continuing to walk in faith and believing on Him. Now, it's easy to say that, and it's difficult sometimes to do, because when you're in the midst of the walk, when you uh, are desiring things to be bigger and better, sometimes it is difficult to uh, remain steadfast and unmovable as you deal with the small things. But it's okay, amen. Trust in God. Keep your eyes stayed on Him and not on your surroundings. And God will bring you through and He will fulfill His promise in your life. So, if you find yourself right now and you are in the day of small things, please understand, if it came from God, chances are very good. It's not going to stay that way. Amen. Because God's plans are always bigger than us. And God does all things well. So continue to trust in Him, continue to believe in Him, even in the small things. And know that as you do that, God will bring you to a greater place if you continue to walk with Him in patience, in love, and in obedience. God bless you. Until next time, be encouraged. Amen. Be encouraged. And know that Jesus loves you, and His love never fails. Yeah. I got the victory.